with Rod finding Hasegawa. Just ticks the ball over in midfield, out to the right-hand side. Kelly will have a look up, wants to get the better of her defender. Her cross loops in at the near post. It took a deflection off uh, Naomi Lazel, and it's gone for Manchester City's first corner of the game. Good conditions for the game as the ball uh, from Alexandri runs past Kennedy, but out to Fowler on the left-hand side. Here is Kennedy again, steps away from the centre circle, Morgan. Hasegawa, Angle Dahl's made the run in the right, but the ball is tight to the byline. Short trying to steal it at the near post, hasn't got over the line, it has now. And Jill Rod gets her second WSL goal of the season. Shaw sure might have thought she'd done enough, but Jill Rod made sure of it. And Manchester City have just needed nine first half minutes to open the scoring against Bristol City this afternoon. Kelly is closer to the touchline than she is the corner of the box. Manchester City patient in their play. They're going to have to be this afternoon as Angledown just tried to play a reverse spall, a disguise pass through to Kelly on the right. Didn't work. Here's Morgan. Greenwood joins the attack on the left-hand side. Fowler stayed out on the far side touchline. Now we'll run up and chase up against Napier. Gets the cross in. It's a good one. Keeper flaps at it. He's going to drop to Kelly off the line. Kelly maybe with a second chance. Away by Bristol City. Bunny Shaw denied her first WSL goal of the season. I'm sure she will get chance to get it back. And maybe now on the left of the penalty area, she tries to lay off on this occasion. Hasegawa on the edge of the D, just forces it out wide to the right. Kelly will go near post. And Marchese punches over. Still no goal against Bristol City at home for Chloe Kelly. Alexandri trying to cause some mischief in the box as well as Greenwood sends it in, left-footed, the header is flicked on! And Alexandri gets Manchester City's second goal of the afternoon, her first goal of the season. And a perfect delivery from Alex Greenwood. The left boot delivering once again. And Alexandri just had to guide it on target, she did just that. Bristol City stranded. And after 33 minutes, it's Manchester City 2, Bristol City 0. Greenwood wants to use the run from Kelly. So Kelly out wide left now, and Fowler on the right. Little change in tactic from Gareth Taylor, the Manchester City women's manager. And space opens up for Angledahl. Straight at Marchese. 20 yards out, decent effort. Anywhere else might have caused Marchese problems, but she gathers on her goal line. Here's Hasegawa. Stretches her legs to the right of the penalty area. Fowler, left footy crosses a good one. Sure! You know what happens next. Denied earlier in the first half, not this time. Buddy Shaw inside the six yard box with a cross on the right hand side. A glanced header into the bottom left-hand corner of the goal. And Bunny Shaw's WSL account opens now. Manchester City 3, Bristol City 0. And Kelly wants to put through Shaw, who gets the control. Shaw, good parry by Marchese. Shaw in on the right-hand side, 12 yards from goal, put through by Kelly. Here's Kelly. Where's the loose ball going on the deflection? It's found a way through to Greenwood, and she's put in Shaw. Shaw on the right from the angle, tipped over by Marchese. Two good saves from the Bristol City goalkeeper in the last minute or so. What's the run of Shaw which comes? It's a nice ball by Morgan. Uses Shaw in a little strip of shade on this near side. Shaw will move to the right corner of the penalty area, lays it off for Alexandri, who might have a taste for goals. No, Hasegawa with the shot. And it's a salmon-like save from Marchese. Greenwood is five yards away from the ball on the right-hand touchline. Kelly raises two arms in the air. It's an outswinging delivery, floated in. Headed away by Bristol City, but only to the edge of the penalty area. Well, Angledahl will collect. She'll try and force the issue up against Jones. Angledahl to Fowler, cross comes in. Heads go up, that's 4-0. And Jill Rod is there again for Manchester City. Three goals in three WSL games for her now. Big smile on her face as well. Fowler with another assist. This time from the far side, the left. 
Gilrod got in at the near post. It nestles home. And before half time, Manchester City have four. Back out to the right for Angledal, who takes a step infield. Then we'll use Kelly with a reverse pass. Kelly across goal and Shaw. It's over the line. It's a second for Shaw. Marchese would have thought she'd done enough with the parry of Kelly's cross. Not to be. It's a simple header home for Bunny Shaw. Her third goal in her last two games, her second of the afternoon here. Alexandre to Morgan on the right-hand touchline. Here's Kelly with a yellow headband on her head, and she sends the cross in from the right-hand side. Keepers come again for it. Might fall to Shaw. Over the bar, she was on the turn, six yards out. City come forward here. Lovely footwork by Jill Rod. wanted to get the shot away, saw the hat-trick headlines. Ball was squeezed out by the defenders. Into the centre circle for Ruby Mace. It's another City up next for Manchester City. They take on Leicester City in six days' time. Here's Shaw on the right-hand side. Will stand up a deep cross for Kelly. It might drop for Hasegawa. And it's wide of the left-hand post from close range. Bouncing ball on the half volley. Here's another chance, though. Shaw trying to turn on the edge of the box. It might come to Rod. She wants the hat-trick. She shoots. It deflects wide. Corner. 18 yards out. Pretty central, Jill Rod. Greenwood out to Kelly. The two England internationals combining, and Kelly will bring it in on that right boot. As we know, she can. She'll go for goal herself. And Marchese had good sight of that all the way. It's on target from Chloe Kelly. It'll be a happy changing room for Manchester City, though, as they are set to go top of the WSL. Oh, Shaw has got the turn. This is for the hat-trick. Bunny Shaw rounds the goalkeeper and can't squeeze it home. Marchese, brilliant recovery. Got down well on the left-hand side of the box. So Shaw couldn't find a route home. And denied a hat-trick because there goes the full-time whistle. Manchester City, with all the work done in the first half, have beaten Bristol City by five goals to nil. Jill Rod started it. Lyra Alexandri got goal number two. But he's sure at the double as well. And Jill Rod also added another goal to get a brace in this game. But he sure could have had a hat-trick right at the end. No goals in the second half might be somewhat surprising given how the first went, but Manchester City have to be happy with how they've performed today. Five goals, a clean sheet, they're top of the WSL, they're unbeaten at the start of the season.